Corrine Powell Jobs. She and her husband were married over 20 years and raised three children. Before the interview, she made it very clear to us she would not discuss her husband's death. She says she will never discuss her husband's death because it's a private family matter. But she would talk about all that he left us with. For reasons that are your own and you are, of course, entitled to for the rest of your life, there are subjects you don't want to discuss. And I'm not going to ask them. I'm going to ask you one question, and that is about legacy. Is there anything you would correct about your husband's legacy as it's been laid before us? Well, I think Steve has a public legacy and a private legacy. In the public, we see the products that he created, that he cared so deeply about, uh, that changed all of our lives, the way that we function and communicate. What he wanted to do in his life was create tools that allowed people to work at the highest levels. And I think he did that. In, and so that legacy is beautiful for me to live with. Um, his private legacy with me and the kids is that of husband and father, and uh, we miss him every day. And having the kind of the body of work surrounding us is actually a really beautiful reminder. And I find it touching and inspiring for me to make sure that I continue to do what I'm most passionate about, and I hope my kids feel the same way. That's another way of saying we're left with a world of really cool stuff. I always wanted to know what it was like to be a Kennedy and drive to Kennedy Airport, and what it's like to be you at a light and watch 10 people cross, and the only thing they have in common are white earbuds. What's that like? It's pretty cool. <laughs> it's pretty cool. I mean, that changed our world. Yeah. To do what you want to do, to leave a mark um, in a way that you think is important and lasting, there's, that's a life well lived. Pretty finite list of people who get to say that.